first I feel proud for the whole team. They did great, great work. And when we started um, to talk about this test field at the beginning of this year, uh, I dreamed that it would become so perfect, but it's really well done. I feel exceptionally well about it. I just feel great. I'm very happy that we succeeded and have uh, built in within four and a half months the whole landscape, the, the ponds here and the technique, well, the kitchen and everything and I'm just happy. And it's the first time we have that system in a real test in life, you know, and not just for presentation. And I'm happy for that as well. A warm welcome to our test field for the planned solar village in Tamera. <laughs> So, thank you all very much for giving us the opportunity in this wonderful country with wonderful people and wonderful sunshine, Portugal, to open our test field. So, and for now, I personally would like to use this moment, which is for me of great excitement, to give thank you to the team that made this miracle happen. But there is light and there is energy from a new solar technology and uh, giving you this autonomy. For every one of us, we need to understand that it's a love affair and we only need to share. So come on, come on, sing. It is important to, to spread the idea because uh, I live in Africa and I know that these things are uh, important there. Our school and my group, we're trying to have get information about this this new technology that is coming into our world so we thought we came here because here it's being developed and created the use of uh, this all these energies and i would really like to know how they do it and if i can take some ideas as well and uh, take it to my place it's like a um, self-sufficient unit which in itself non-pollutant uh, so that's very good and it's the basics of i think of a new revolution i think that uh, you know speaking in terms of physics this we reach the critical mass now i mean that will become very attractive also to the outside world and uh, as you know uh, this is a step to go to the TTT platform, to Solar University, uh, to Solar Village. And uh, this will require, beside all our talents and efforts, some money. So I think uh, that we have a very fair chance that this will trigger some outside, outside funds so that we can go bigger. We offer the world a model which we have invested in. And we are looking for people who understand this and who say, okay, how can my children profit from this? And they can only profit if now we go to the next step. We make the extension, we make the education, uh, we start manufacturing, we bring in people from all over the world to teach them. And this, we can't do this all by our own meanings, but we put the seed. And I think future will need systems like that. I mean, it's it's no way to go on like it is with the mega systems. And so we want to have a, a model in a model here in Tamera to show how life could be in future. That's a test as well, you know, how people live with technology and ecology. How these things are coming together, especially also architecture, social architecture. And what we want to do here is uh, do that test, planning next year very hard the solar village platform. Uh, we 
going to build in the wing area of Tamera and having then an education part to it as well. And I'm really happy to go to look forward to that time. And uh, maybe this inauguration here, this event will be, bring us more support from all over the country and the world.